behind this curtain? Let's check it out. How beautiful is this place? Look at the bar. But over here, I'm Hi guys, welcome to another video from New York City. So today we're gonna go to Tin Building. You see that? Tin Building. And you're gonna love it. And I'll show you why it's a must visit. So let's go guys. So guys, this is Tin Building. We're gonna go inside. It's like a high-end food place. There's all kinds of fantastic food places over here. This whole theme is mostly French, but there are other kinds of restaurants and uh, bars are over here too. So how beautiful is this? Look at it. There's like fresh produce over here. It's like a market also. You will have like fresh meat. And there's the bar over there. The mostly the theme is French. Look at the cheese places. Hi. It's like all cheese from all over the world, or is it mostly French? Okay. Thank you. So you will see a lot of that over here. Look at this. And here is another wine bar. There is another bar over there. And there is like seafood places all over. It's like oysters and other kinds of fresh seafood. And then there is, on that side is the patisserie. And wow, that looks yummy. Let's check it out, guys. Let's check it out. That really, really looks yummy. This is a flower store. Flowers are over here. Fresh bread. Pastries. Wow, this looks yummy, guys. So guys, there's more food stuff over here. Gourmet food, you can see. It's very, very yummy and fresh. Pretty high end. So, as you can see, the stuff is very interesting. The produce that you see is interesting. The food is interesting. If you are in New York City, definitely come over here. I'll put a link below just to show where this place is. And it's a must visit. That's what I'm saying. Wow, look at this beautiful place. It's like candy store. Yes, it's like all kinds of fantastic candies over here. This place looks beautiful. Wow. Oh my god, this is this is yummy. This place is amazing and it's pretty, pretty new actually. It's a, you know, this is the South Streets basically converted this place and made into this tin building by Jean Jean. This is amazing. So guys, let's go upstairs. Let's take the escalator over upstairs. Check out what's on the second floor of this market. Guys, look at this beautiful bar over here. Wow, this looks so exotic. It's so high-end. Seeds and weeds is some of the plant-based products that they sell over here. And look at the produce. It's very unique stuff over here. Very unique stuff. I'm not sure exactly. I think those are like truffles. Wow, look at the truffles over here. Here is the price list for all of... It's not that expensive. It's about 12 to 18. Some of them are very ex a little bit more high-end which is 38 bucks but I love this packaging this packaging is so beautiful wow very quaint stuff very cool wow look at this all kinds of wow look at the cups this is beautiful the olive oils this is like a chef's paradise if you're into cooking and if you're into you know culinary stuff you will come over here and buy all these ingredients and just go home and just cook it up look at this this is beautiful all kinds of beans i'm sure wow 
Look at this. Yeah, these are all beans. Look at the prices. Not that expensive. This kind of. These are rice. This is brown rice. This is pasta, semolina. Wow. This is a very high end gourmet. And they have got fantastic ingredients. Like, very, very hard to find ingredients over here. So, if you, as I said, if you're into cooking, this is the place you should come and uh, buy some of this stuff and take home and cook. Um, wow, look at this. This is a kettle. Wow. I'm just loving this place. Just loving it. And look at this. Wow. What is this? It's called the Mercantile. And I think they have got... Oh, this is kind of the Asian... Yeah, this is if you're into Asian cooking, this is the place you want to come. This kind of walking oils, vinegar, etc. This is this is the place if you're. Oh, here you go, miso paste. It's very unique and look at it looks like like your Asian theme to it and how it sort of changed, you know, from being in the western kind of italian and french ingredients and the shops to very asian this is just beautiful they have got very very unique stuff yeah these are like vinegars all kinds of cooking vinegars you're going to use it for you know these are ingredients for all kinds of asian cooking wow very unique very very unique this is unique wow What is this? This is soy sauce. Absolutely an ingredient for any sort of Asian cooking. This is a Korean jam. Wow, look at this, guys. This is a Korean jam. Anyways, let's find a place to eat because I'm hungry. Need to eat something. So let's get a quick place and I will show you what we're going to be eating. Now from an Asian theme to a Mexican theme. This is a taquito place. It's Mexican food over here. You have guacamole, side salad, chips and salsa, all of that. So basically the world cuisine is over here. You have Asian, you have Mexican, you have European, French, Italian, everything over there, guys. And look at this decor, look at this whole theme, it's just fantastic. It's a must visit, guys. Please definitely come over here. So guys, if you're loving my video, please hit the subscribe button and the like button and the bell icon to get notified for any new videos that I come up with because I'm going to be coming up with a lot of new videos. And please, please put a comment below because I want to know how you feel about my videos, what you like, what you don't like, which other places you want me to cover. Please, that's very important. So thank you so much for watching. Let's go and eat somewhere. Let's try this out. Mm. This is yummy. It's like fresh tomato juice with vodka, infused vodka, and with olives. It's just amazing. Love it. And now let's try the oysters. Let's see how that is. So, the way to eat the oysters is. Put over here. I want the like the tartar sauce. Some of this vinegar. And put this freshly squeezed lemon. 
Let's put it in. Mm. This is amazing. Amazing. So guys, what's behind this curtain? Let's check it out. Wow, is something secret? Oh, I think so. Let's check it out. Let's check it out. Wow. This is a restaurant. How beautiful is this place? Look at the bar. It's an Asian restaurant. And it's beautiful absolutely beautiful how it's kind of the speakeasy theme about this place and it's just wonderful so let's go and check it out what kind of food they have and i'm going to put a link below about the name of the restaurant and all that so definitely come over here if you're in uh, the tin building wow look at how beautiful this place is look at the settings Wow, this is the kitchen guys this is where the magic happens and this is a very very famous hi guys <laughs> wow look at look at the food this is where all the magic happens over here all the expert chefs are over here cooking up really really flavorful Asian food so let's eat and let's see how the food is I'm very sure this is gonna be awesome let's check it out so let's see what's on the menu guys Wow, look at how beautiful this menu is. It looks like an Asian fan. Just like a fan, guys. So, you have noodles, you have veggies, you have appetizers, you have seafood, you have meat. And everything is super expensive, but it's a little bit pricey because, you know, this is a high-end place. And let's see what's for drinks. Oh, they have got nice red wine, white wine, and all kinds of beautiful cocktails, and of course beer. So guys, ordered some great food, and waiting for the drinks to show up, and as soon as it comes, I will show you how, what we are eating. As I said, it's a pretty cool place, and the prices are definitely reasonable. It's a, you know, it's a high-end place, so it's, it's not very cheap, but for New York prices, I think it's very, very reasonable. So let's see how the good, how the food is, and I will give you a whole review. So I hope you're enjoying this video. Uh, the service is so good. It's like they give you this old towels. I feel rejuvenated. This is a. I just love the service over here. Everybody is so nice, so cool. You know, they they are doing the job properly. This is what makes this place so, really so nice. So guys, this is the spicy cucumber. It's with doused with sesame oil and sesame seeds. Let's try it out. Let's see how it is. Mmm. It's not spicy but very refreshing. It's not hot. Actually there are spices and it kind of bursts in your mouth and you can feel the sesame oil and the sesame seeds and it's so refreshing and the cucumber is so fresh. Guys, this is fantastic. So guys, this is the pork dumplings in chili oil. I'm gonna try it out. Uh, thank you, the mezcal. Thank you so much. I'm gonna try this out. It's, it has got nice chili oil over here so I'm just putting it dousing it a little bit on this and mm. oh my god this is so good the chili oil is not hot it has the spice and the flavors it just bursts in your mouth and the pork is very tender it's very very well done this is so yummy so now I'm going to try out the mezcal on the rocks. Mm. It's really good. It's a smoky mezcal on the rocks. And it goes very well with 
the spice, yeah, spicy, yeah. not not hot, but yeah. kind of spicy food. Because the spices, being spicy versus hot is very different. Because these are these are very flavorful. That's what makes it very different, and it's just awesome, guys. So, if you're here, come to Pearl. If you're in New York City, come to the Tin Building. Come to Pearl, it's in South Street Seaport area. It's in downtown Manhattan, and you will love it. So guys, this is the spicy mala chicken we ordered. It has got red peppers and scallions, and looks, and some sesame, you know, seeds on top. So let's check it out, let's check it out. Let's dig in, guys. It's fresh chicken, just kind of a little bit stir fried with the sesame on top. Mm. Oh my god. This is fabulous. You can taste the, the red peppers on it, the kind of flavor, the chevron flavor, with the scallions, with the sesame, with a little bit of you know, spring onions in it. Oh my god, this is so yummy. This is fabulous, guys. So guys, we have the spare ribs. It looks yummy. So now we have to try it out and see how it is. Let's give it a try. Mm. Succulent. It's uh, raised with some kind of a sauce on top. Let's see how it is. Mm. I think it's there's some barbecue and honey on top of it with some Asian spices. It's just yummy. And the meat is so tender, it just you know falls off the bone. This is so, so different from regular spare ribs that you have. And this is also like, you know, in Chinese restaurants, you don't get spare ribs. But this is very, very different, very unique flavors. So guys, this is also a must. I'm going to put all my favorite ones in the description section what we ate over there. So when you come over here, you know what to get. So guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. So I'm going to end the video tonight see you very soon hope you have a great evening and ciao from new york city take care